All right. Now our entire desktop flow is ready to extract the data from National Stock Exchange. But there are the last few steps are required to schedule this Power Automate desktop. Before that, let me go back to the National Stock Exchange project. There, if you see, I'm going to extract this data or this data will be updated on daily basis. Now, this video has been created on 25th, October 2022. But again, there is the data every day that we want to extract the data in a such a way. So the weekdays, this NSC will get updated based on the category. Now, how can we go ahead and schedule it to extract the data on daily basis? In Power Automate Desktop, we don't have the future to schedule our desktop flows, right? Then how can we go ahead and do that? This feature is available in Microsoft Power Automate portal, that is make.powerautomate.com or flow.microsoft.com. Recently, flow.microsoft.com has changed to make.powerautomate.com. And then you are going to create a new scheduled flow and then you are calling the desktop flow from this scheduled flow. How can we go ahead and do that? Now I'm going to create a new schedule flow by clicking on create. Now we can schedule our desktop flows by using scheduled cloud flows. From here onwards, we can call our desktop flow that is national stock exchange desktop project. All right. Now let's click on schedule cloud flow to choose on what are the dates that we need to run. Okay, fine. Now what I'm going to say, I'm going to give the flow name as schedule NSC project. Okay, now this second option you can see over here, run this flow when you want to start it. I'm going to say every day 10 a.m. so that it will start from today onwards, that is 25th October 2022. And if you see over here, repeat every one time, that is one time a day, and then when it has to be done, every week that I need to select. So once you are going to select, I need to run the desktop flows from on weekdays, such as Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, but not on the Saturday and Sunday. So that this flow will run on these days, that is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of every week. All right, let me click on create. Now, once again, if you see, I got the action over here as recurrence. Let's expand this so that you can see this flow will run on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday in every week. But how can we call the desktop flow over here? I'm going to add new step. And there you can see, I want to choose an operation or the connectors to connect the actions. There you can see I'm having desktop flows. Now, this is our desktop flow, right? That is national stock exchange project has created from the desktop flows. Now, I'm going to call this desktop flow by selecting the option desktop flows from the my scheduled cloud flows. I'm going to select that desktop flows. And then you can see there are two options over here. Run your flow built with a Power Automate desktop, which is required premium. So that the mean you need to get the license to run this desktop flows from the cloud flows. I'm going to select that because of I'm having premium license over here. And then if you see desktop flows is the option that we have. Before that, I need to connect to create the connection to the desktop flow. How can we go ahead and connect it? Now there are three dots over here. I'm going to select that. And then I'm going to add new connection. And then if you see the parameters, connect, I'm going to give directly to machine and then machine group or what? There you can see I'm having desktop, HD SRS is E8 is my desktop. And then we are going for domain and username. How can we get this domain and username? Now go to the windows and then search for the command prompt and then click on the command prompt. And then I will give the command as who am I? And then if you click it here, you can find the domain and the username. I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to give the domain and username. Once it has been given, it will ask for the password, which I'm having for the system password. And then I'm going to click on create. Before this one, how can we connect to the directly to the machine? There is one app called Power Automate Machine Runtime. 
how can we go ahead and do that we'll go for the windows and then we'll search for power automate machine runtime just click on that and then your machine whichever you want to connect directly to the machine it has to be registered over here in the power automate machine runtime now if you see the machine details over here i got it as desktop hds rs e8 which is the same as the given in the machine or machine group all right now to run this power automate machine runtime again you have to go back to the services.msc and there you can see over here i am having power automate service running and the power automate update service also is running so especially to run the machine runtime i need to make this service that is power automate service has to be in the status of running now let me click on create now the connection between power automate cloud flow as well as power automate desktop has run successfully through power automate machine runtime now if you see i'm going to select the desktop flow by selecting an item over here there you can see whatever the desktop flows we have been created in by using power automate desktop software all the desktop flows will be loaded over here now what is the project name that you are going to select that is national stock exchange project let's click on that and then if you see the second parameter run mode what are the modes that we are having there you can see that is attended or unattended attended means this flows will run when you are signed in unattended means the runs on a machine that is that signed out all right now i am going to select attended and then if you see the show advanced options there is only one parameter that have on priority basis there you can see i am having high normal and enter your custom values i am going to give it as high for the time being or you can select it the priority on your requirement basis and then i'm going to click on save now the flow has saved successfully now if you observe we are ready with our entire national stock exchange project to do the analysis on the stocks such as we have created a scheduled cloud flow as well as we have created the entire desktop flow to extract the data from the national stock exchange project and also we have called this desktop flow by using scheduled cloud flows on daily basis based on requirement such as monday tuesday wednesday thursday and finally friday now we'll see the output by clicking on run from the cloud flows that is scheduled cloud flows